which is like the Home Depot here in Okinawa. And we have been on the search for a floor lamp. So um, hopefully we are lucky at Makeman and we find something there. But I just wanted to take you guys so you guys can see what it looks like inside. So wish us luck. So our first stop is at Makeman. Can we just first admire how cool these seats are for the kids? My daughter doesn't really like sitting in seats at the stores, so this one is the only exception. So Makeman is basically like the Home Depot of Okinawa, and it's one of the bigger home improvement stores here. There's a few in different locations. We're just looking around right now and looking at all the different things because there's just so much to look at and they have a pretty wide variety of baskets and they have so many things for organization. I'm giving you guys an idea of what the rug selection is like here in Okinawa. A lot of people mention if you move here to make sure you get rugs before you move to Okinawa. And that's mainly because there are rugs here, but the variety is very limited. So if you have a certain preference, it's highly encouraged to buy something before you come to Japan. And now I'm just looking at some cushion mats for the kitchen area. I ended up getting this one that's really cute. Almost everything is measured in centimeters, so I always struggle with trying to convert it to inches. So this pen selection I had to show you guys, but there are actually stationary stores here in Japan that have a huge variety of pens. I hope to do a video soon so you guys can see how incredible the selection of office supplies there are here. So there's a huge DIY area of the store and they just have like a bunch of wood. You can even get wood cut and paint and everything you could possibly think of. They have it here, which is pretty cool. I hope to do more DIY projects in the near future. I was trying to look for a new house plant but there was nothing that really stood out to me so I ended up not getting anything but I still love looking around at all the plants and just admiring the vegetation here in Japan. It's just so beautiful. <laughs> These are the artificial plants for those who may not have green thumbs. Everything is a little bit overpriced in this area, so I kind of just browsed through and went on my way. <laughs> when I try to speak Japanese but um let's see if we get lucky I am like really determined to find me a floor lamp let's just see what we can find so at the Sakumoto this store was actually like a smaller make man so I wasn't able to find anything here but of course I still like to go through and look at everything <laughs> Happy Meal 
12 chicken nuggets. Yes. And can I get the spicy chicken? So I'm going to show you guys what we got from McDonald's. Some chicken nuggets, fries. I got to show you guys what I got. I got the spicy chicken sandwich. It's not like the hot and spicy in the States. It is like a chicken sandwich and it has, it's a different type of hot sauce. And then um, it has lettuce in it. I've already had this sandwich like 10 times since I've been here. It's so funny because I never ate McDonald's in the States. I just like, it didn't appeal to me. But the McDonald's here in Japan is so freaking good. I try not to eat it that often, but sometimes when we're on the go, like going to different stores and stuff, I like to get me some McDonald's and Gigi loves the fries and the orange juice. Hi, Gigi. And then it always comes with a really cool toy in the Happy Meal, so Gigi loves that too. So here is the toy. Let me open it. Look at Gigi, it's a store. And then it has a little chick. A penguin. I'm gonna say it's a penguin. So cute. Here you go, Gigi. Okay, so today is a new Mama. day. Mama! What? The search continues for a new floor Mama. lamp. I have another store to go to, Mama. so let's see what we can find there. So I was so happy to find a lighting section here at the Kane store. I did find this one that I really liked if it was a different color scheme. Since the walls in my house are gray, I just felt like that color would blend in a little bit too much and it just wouldn't stand out. And it was almost a hundred dollars and i just didn't feel like it was necessary to spend that much money on a lamp and so i skipped out on that one and again i have to show the rug selection especially if there's anybody watching who is moving over here just so you guys can have an idea of what is offered here in japan and of course more baskets japan is all about organization Okay, so I actually came to Nutori a couple weeks ago to find a floor lamp and I couldn't find anything. So I decided, you know what, let me just check one more time just to see if there's anything here that I like. Now this store is pretty equivalent to like Ikea, maybe not as big, but there are so many things for um, organization, especially like the baskets, as well as home decor and house items that you may need. I saw all of these beautiful mirrors that I was very tempted to purchase, but I don't really need one yet. I was really hopeful when I went to the lighting section. Luckily, they had a really nice selection. There was one particular lamp that I absolutely loved. It was this black one that you see here. I really wanted to get this one, but they're out of stock until March and I just couldn't wait that long. So I ended up getting my second favorite. If I don't like it, maybe I'll go back and purchase the other one in March. But for now, this one's gonna have to do. That is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed seeing all the different home improvement stores here. And um, we are gonna go eat right now. I'm starving. Um, we're just gonna go on base and run some errands. So if you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe to my channel. Click the little bell notification so you can be notified when I post new videos. My name is Rochelle, this is Mama Mentality, and like always, I'm sending love and light your way. Bye! Hi!